Okay, for this tutorial, we're going to be using a GraphTech Pro Studio, and I'm going to show you how to create a word or font and send it to your cutter in one or two color paths. We'll start with File, New. We'll have to set our media width. Mine is 15. Now here is our artboard. Text, D A D. Enter. Now at this point we can make it bigger or smaller or we can even enter it the size over here. Drag that there. There's our solid color. Now typically I would make this the same color as the vinyl I'm going to be using just so I can keep it clear when I'm cutting. So here's our first word. Now if we wanted to separate or excuse me add a second path say behind it make it a sticker outline if you will we go to effects outline and so now there we have the background of it if we're happy with that size we're good if we want to make it smaller if we want to make it bigger doesn't matter size we're okay now we have our front artwork and our back artwork effects separate now we can drag our second color over this is our front, this is our back. Again, now I would, for all practical purposes, change what color media I would be using in the back and call it green vinyl for whatever reason. So now we're good. Now we're gonna, we have to select both. File, cut plot. So here you'll see that we have both colors here and it is mirrored. In vinyl, you're going to be mirroring it because you're going to be cutting the back of it, uh, i.e. transparency upside down. So now we have both of our artwork panels here. We're only going to be using one vinyl at a time. So we're going to have to come up to this options bar and pick which media we're going to cut first. So now we would send the, the yellow through, hit send, reload our media when that's done click on just a green click send and there you have it I don't I don't have it personally uh, printing right now or cutting but at least you can see the process and that will successfully work for you hope you enjoyed it please leave your comments thanks